Not the only one seeing these hot temperatures right now. Excessive heat is gripping much of the country right now. The hot temperatures are straining California's power grid, while Phoenix, Arizona is setting a new all-time record today. Ian Schwartz has more. Princess there, 92 degrees, and that's one of our cooler readings. Arizona woke up hot and headed straight for another record breaker. Now 19 consecutive days and counting above 110 degrees. Read them and weep, people. More of uh, the weeping going on for sure. That heat can pose serious dangers for the vulnerable, like those without housing. Some ice cold water, a hat, some sunscreen, anything like that is a lifeline for people in need. Arizona's power grid is holding its own, but Californians are urged to conserve and keep that thermostat at 78 degrees to avoid potential blackout. When you've got really hot temperatures that don't cool down at night, that can be really taxing on the electrical equipment. When the nighttime temperatures don't cool down and things stay hotter longer, people also stay hotter longer. Julie Tartan is leading the effort to build the National Integrated Heat Health Information System and says summers like this one could be here to stay. The reality is we are expecting every part of the United States and most parts of the world to, to have increased heat waves, increased heat events. Basketball legend Shaquille O'Neal cooled off in Hawaii but it's the calm before the storm. As Tropical Storm Calvin approaches, residents are advised to be prepared. Make sure they have their, their go kits, their you know, safety kits for their homes, whether that be lights and uh, water and things like that. Good advice to be ready for any kind of weather. Ian Schwartz, CBS News, Phoenix, Arizona.